Hello everyone and welcome back to my video series on the Starship Troopers Terran Command Scenario Editor and today we are going to be revisiting and talking about Blackboard Names. So Blackboard Names is a very interesting tool where you can add in a system name that you can reference in different triggers. So let's get into it. Adding a unit to the Blackboard is quite simple. You simply need to create a trigger and use the effect called blackboard add unit. So let's go ahead and create a trigger here. I'm going to call this blackboard and we're going to add the effect blackboard add unit. Now the first thing that we're going to do to, is we're going to show how to add a blackboard name to an existing unit. So, this is useful if you don't want to keep clicking on the same unit over and over and over again and coming back and forth, back and forth. This way that throughout your triggers, you can just type in whatever Blackboard name you give. For example, I'm going to store this, this unit as Trooper1. So, now anytime I go in, I don't, I can be all the way down here on the other end of the map and I can create another trigger and I can do a condition trooper one in this blackboard name box and create a trigger that when trooper one is over here do something so instead of having to come back and forth and click this trooper I just have to remember that blackboard name and I'll be able to do all sorts of fun stuff. So that's how you add a blackboard name to a unit already on the map. And it's a very, very versatile system. So there's a lot that you can do with it. So one thing that is even more useful with this is when you have a unit that doesn't exist on the map yet, but you want triggers to happen. So let's go ahead and talk through that really quick. So I'm going to go ahead and create a new trigger here. And I'm going to say spawn liaison. So I'm going to go into spawn unit. I'm going to spawn a liaison. I'm going to spawn them right here. And I'm going to give this unit preemptively a blackboard name of fleet. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to immediately have that liaison fleet execute an ability, a tax strike right here. Now, keep in mind, if you are going to be immediately doing an action or some such to a unit, you have to give a few seconds for that unit to fully spawn and be on the map before issuing orders. Six to seven seconds is about uh, the time that you want. So, now what this is going to do is the fleet liaison is going to spawn and we've already given it an action because of the blackboard name. So we are able to give actions to units that don't exist yet as long as we reference that blackboard name. So let's give it a shot. So we have here our liaison spawning and then immediately our liaison drop their ability. So now uh, that it's a little quieter, I'm going to repeat myself. So immediately that liaison started spawning. And as soon as they got done spawning, we, with the blackboard name that we assigned this unit, we had it execute an ability. Sir. We can see that very briefly was on cooldown. 
we had it execute an ability and we were able to give it that task even though it doesn't exist on the map yet. So those are different ways that you can use the Blackboard name and just very briefly touching this. So if you have any further questions regarding Blackboard names and how to use them and some other creative uses on how to take advantage of the system, check out the official Terran Command Discord or my Discord, both in the links down below in the description. Thank you all and have a great day.